Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to activate the Wi-Fi hotspot feature in Windows 10. So basically, so you'll be able to share your wireless connection with other devices. And there is really no on or off switch to this. However, there are different ways to activate it. And it's going to be very straightforward. Please note you have to have an administrative account in order to utilize this feature or at least to set it up. So we're going to start by right clicking on our start menu or start button. So right click on the start button and then left click on command prompt admin. If you receive a user account control window select yes. So now we want to do is type in NET SH space W LAN, WLAN, and then space set, another space hosted network, one, all one word, so hosted network should be one word, and then you want to type in mode, another space mode equals allow, another space SSID equals, now you can name this whatever you want, this will just be referred to as a name of your wireless network and it can be set to anything and the key can be changed to anything as well so you don't really have to worry about that so so SSID can be set to anything I'm just gonna type MD Tech videos give my channel a little shout out there and then I'm gonna do another space key equals and at this point you would enter whatever password you want I'm just gonna say password because I like simple passwords for these kind of videos even though I would probably recommend doing a little bit of a stronger password um, on your end. So once you type that in, hit enter on your keyboard. So if you receive this error saying the wireless auto config service is not running, head over to the start menu and then you want to type in services. It should say desktop app right below it. So right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. So the first thing we're going to do is head down and we're going to try and find our Windows Connection Manager and we're going to right click on it and then left click on Properties. Make sure it's set to the automatic position and then we're going to head down until we get to WLAN Auto Config. Right click on that and then left click on Start. Let's take a moment to so just be patient. And it should say it's running. So if we copy that again, so I'm just going to do control C and then I'm going to do control V. Enter. Okay. So we resolve that error. So maybe that'll be a whole video in itself right there. But anyway, so we're good to go. So we're going to type in now NETSH space WLAN. Another space, start, another space, host, hosted network. Hosted network should be one word, and then hit enter. So then it should say the hosted network started. Now you want to type in net, it's sh, space, wlan, stop hosted network hosted network again should be one word and then hit enter and should say the hosted network stopped so at this point you can close out of the command prompt and you should be good to go so I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out and I will catch you in the next video goodbye